Hi, this is Melanie for Pardesi Reviews, and I'm here to do a double trailer reaction to the two teasers of Avane Srimana Rayana, a new Kannada film. If you're new to Pardesi Reviews, I do mainly film reviews and trailer reactions of Hindi, Telugu, Tamil, and Malayalam films but very rarely I do a Canada one. And I've had complaints that I haven't done any Canada cinema lately. There's two teasers. The second teaser just came out this week of this film, Avani Srimana Rayana, starring Rakshit Shetty. Evidently it's quite a sensation. So I'm gonna watch both teasers to, because both of them are pretty short. Uh, the first teaser came out quite a bit ago. I'm not exactly sure when the release date. I have a feeling this one was delayed because I saw some posters saying coming in December. So I'm assuming if this teaser is coming out now, maybe this is an August release. Uh, I don't know. So let me know if, if you know anything about the release date. I know almost next to nothing about Canada cinema. Canada films don't often play near me in the Chicago area. So KGF was a big enough film that it did play in local cinemas. And oh my God, that one was an amazing film to see on the big screen. I'm really looking forward to part two of that. Other kind of films I've seen are Lucia and the original U-Turn with Shraddha Srinath. Uh, so I haven't seen very many kind of films at all. I looked up this actor, so it looks like he's both an actor and a director and a producer. It's really interesting. He broke out with a rom-com a number of years ago, and this film is a period film. It's set in the 80s, and all I know is he plays some sort of cop in an imaginary village. The other key thing is that it is a first-time director, Sachin Ravi, and what I do like is when big stars in the various industries, give a chance to a new young director, and because everyone flocks to see the star, it gives a new director a chance to uh, gain, gain an audience. So let's watch part, the first teaser, then the second one, and then I'll talk about both at the end. Go. <laughs> ಯಾಯ ನೀತಿ ಯಾವಾಗ ಯಾವಾಗ ನೆಲೆ ಕಳ್ಕೊಳ್ಳುತ್ತೋ ಜನರ ಕೂಗು ಯಾವಾಗ ಮುಗಿಲು ಮುಟ್ಟುತ್ತೋ ಅಧರ್ಮದ ಬಾವುಟ ಯಾವಾಗ ಯಾವಾಗ ಹಾರಾಡುತ್ತೋ ನ್ಯಾಯ ನೀತಿ ಕಾಪಾಡೋಕೆ ಪತಾಕೆನ ಎತ್ತಿ ಹಿಡಿಯೋಕೆ ಆವಾಗ ಆವಾಗ ಅವನು ಬಂದೇ ಬರ್ತಾನೆ ಯಾರೋನು Happy birthday to me. <laughs> hey, yeah, this December. Maybe. <laughs> I love it already. <laughs> okay, now for the second one. Go. I'm going to go to the ನನ್ನ ನೋಡಿದಿರಿ ಜಯರಾಮ ನನ್ನ ಪ್ರತಿಕೆ ಇನ್ನು ಮುಂದೆ ನಿನ್ನ ಜವಾಬ್ದಾರಿ ಸ್ವಾಮಿ 
so creepy. Rakshasana yadras bek adre. Modalu nammola ge na rakshasan inda mukta nag beko. Agnana na metti nil beko. Antha karana seal beko. Aniti anna manus beko. Avaga. नम्मोलगे उन्हों जाग्रुतन आक्ता ने यारू हैप्पी बर्थडे That is a cool transition. <laughs> Very soon. first one I thought it was because it was the star's birthday and it, I mean because frequently we have those releases of trailers or releases of moving posters or stuff like that for a star's birthday but then in the second teaser the old phonograph player was playing the American Happy Birthday song which it's funny is rarely used in movies because they keep renewing the rights of it, so you have to pay money to use it in a TV show or a movie or something. So, it, it but Indian movies, they don't worry about that. They just put it in there. But anyway, I just thought that was uh, the whole thing with him lighting with the torch, a cigar, and then he was setting fire. I love that the, the transition of the lamp and all of the oil catching fire and then, and then it went into the next scene. I love the humor of them, of the little figure of him kicking the, you know, maybe to, you know, coming soon and then coming very soon. That was so clever and so cute. Uh, I just like the zaniness of this whole thing. Uh, it's not really violent like Quentin Tarantino, but I don't know, just sort of the fun of the action sequences and the fun that... Rakshachetti was having in them reminded me of Quentin Tarantino. I mean, it's like, it has all this sort of Western, like a Western U.S. movie kind of imagery of him coming out of a bar and then all of the bandits are, you know, holding him at gunpoint. That's a very Tarantino kind of a thing. Uh, and I'm just, uh-oh. <laughs> okay, I hope this place near me in Chicago because it looks hilarious. It looks just so much fun. All right, so this star has, I don't know if it was six or eight different films. If I was trying, going to try to seek out one of his films because I did that with Yash. So for KGF. So w which one of his films, like is it his, is that big breakout rom-com, which I can't remember the title of, or is there another film of his that I should see before I possibly see this film? Because this, this guy, <laughs> he's got that star power, whatever it is, that X factor, he's got it. I want to see everything that he's doing on screen. He just takes over the screen. Love it. All right. Thanks for the recommendation for the person who sent me the link to the second teaser. And I thought, well, I should see the first one first. And I'm glad I did because they were both a little bit different. And it looks like we get a little bit of the origin of that uh, sort of villain guy. Like It was weird. It was like, here's the car and you had the flag. And I was like, it looked like a the finger like this. And then you saw 
to say, and the fingers are missing. But in the second teaser, we saw, um, I think now they're mixing, I'm, they're blended in my mind, but we saw a scene where a villain um, cuts those fingers off. So, or, you know, he's lying on the floor with the stumps. So, and he's all crying. So, boy, it looks like we're definitely going to get the backstory of all of that. Fascinating trailers. Love it, love it, love it. Do follow me on Twitter at PardaisyYT. Subscribe here to the Pardaisy Reviews channel. And if you hit the bell, you'll get a notification whenever I have a new trailer reaction or film review.